A series of activities celebrating the 60th anniversary of the establishment of diplomatic ties between China and France will be held at the Shanghai Conservatory of Music throughout the year. Events on the schedule include masterclasses, concerts, and forums, as well as the International Piano Competition of Allianz, which is coming to China for the first time. Founded in 1994 by François Dinn, the competition's Asia-Pacific tour for this year is scheduled to take place on May 11th and 12th at He Luting Concert Hall. The competition was held in Chicago in the United States in March and in Orléans, France, in April before coming to Shanghai. Why Shanghai? Because、uh, it is a very important city.、Uh, is a cultural capital. Is one of the cultural capital of China. And so the idea was、uh, also to bring here maybe something new, new sounds. Because our competition is around the music of 20 and 21st century. During the semi-final stage in France last month, the competition presented the Shanghai Conservatory of Music Composer Award. Hoping that more contemporary works created by Chinese composers can be heard all over the world, the judges at this year's competition are looking for a specific kind of talent. A sort of personality, someone who play、uh, classical music, romantic music,、mm-hmm. but contemporary to something. Some someone who defended the new repertoire, but the whole repertoire too. I was part of the competition a few years ago as a candidate, <laughs> so now as a prize winner, I feel very emotional around this competition to be on the other side as a member of the jury, and especially in. China. I, I, yes, I feel this is a fantastic experience. The conservatory is planning to carry out about 20 projects related to friendship between the two countries, including the concert of the French Chamber Music Quartet and a Sino-French joint opera production to commemorate the 150th anniversary of the French opera Carmen. 我是一个混血儿，我的爸爸是法国人，啊，然后呢，今年是我刚过来，从法国过来来学习古筝，认为民乐这个东西还是要在中国这片土地上学的，所以这就是为什么我过来也是呃最大的根本的不同，就是可以在这片土地上很呃地道的去浸染这个文化。